what year was it? Well, it was your your eighth grade to be a freshman summer and uh, coming down to, to help out with the, the youth football camp. But I think everyone knows that the number of hours that's, that's put into this deal uh, and whether it's going all the way out to Fargo, North Dakota at one point and, and now uh, ending up at Western Illinois. I mean, the, the overall experience, and I think uh, Zeke will attest to it, it's been, uh, it's been fun. It's been uh, it's stressful at times, but uh, yeah, I just the the one thing is that you just want to take away from this experience is that you know you put enough time into something that's this big, um, good things will happen, and uh, I think we're all happy for Zeke, and and uh, this is a pretty special day for not only uh, for you know Isaiah and his family, uh, but obviously for Mount Hoare Barnabas football. So. We'll let uh, Zeke sign away. Uh, it, does mom have any words? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No. All right. I'm extremely Clark proud. That's about it. Thanks, Thanks mom. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I guess I'll sign this now. Uh,
What do they say your role is going to be at Western? Uh, I'm going to come in. I could potentially play as a freshman. So that's what I, I got to work hard to get there, obviously. And that's what I want to do. So I'll be a receiver. I'll be playing the outside wide receiver. So. And, and uh, what do you have to do between now and, and going off to college to be ready to play college football? Um, Besides just, continue to win basketball games. <laughs> <laughs> they said just be me, keep working hard, and I dream will come true. I think I should throw a few questions your coaches with. Yeah. Uh, Travis, what does this moment mean for your program and uh, to get a scholarship recruit? And, you know, even the programs like Juan and Key, this isn't you know something that happens every day. Yeah, you know, like, like we said before, I mean, this is uh, something that hasn't happened since 1985 with Pete Noka. That, play at Wisconsin, so it doesn't happen uh, you know, every year. Uh, it, it's special in the fact that our program has, has been here for since 2008, and our coaching staff, and uh, so this is the first go-around for us, and that's why I even had to ask you questions on, you know, what is the protocol for uh, a day like today, but uh, it's exciting for all of us, and, and, you know, what's going on in the school right now with not only our football program, Gymnastics has always been, and soccer has always been a staple of our athletic programs, but now you start to look at what basketball is doing, uh, being on the ranked number one. Our baseball program won conference last year, and, and so, I mean, this is an exciting time to be a student, be an athlete at Mount Horton High School. What kind of athlete are, is Western Illinois getting in Isaiah? What, they're what would you they're say getting the ultimate competitor. They're getting a kid that, uh, you know, he wears his you know, emotions on his sleeve, uh, and, and that's something that uh, you, know, you, you look for an opportunity as a coach. To, and we, we have a lot of these young men sitting here watching Isaiah today, but you look for guys that are passionate about the game and, um, and, and just love competing. And uh, you know, I don't think there's going to be someone on the field that's going to compete as hard as Isaiah. You now, the thing is, is that the game is obviously just you know, a little bit bigger, a little bit faster, and uh, so. But I think I, you know, I look, you know, forward for great things to come for Isaiah, and, and I think he'll do just fine in Western Illinois. And for young kids in your program, what if they want to play college football? What do they have to do to get to the level that Isaiah's gotten to here, and, and to give themselves a chance? Well, I mean, one Isaiah was blessed with pretty good genetics. I mean, uh, I know both parents were great athletes uh, in, in, uh, in Chicago, so. Yeah, that play obviously plays a role, uh, and uh, so. It, uh, but also, uh, we got guys that have now started all the way down to fourth grade. That have, you know, we have our strength and speed program, and, and Isaiah's always been a part of that. And uh, and, and I also think that you know, uh, success breeds success. So with the programs, all the programs that have had success, uh, you know, we hope that you know some some of the folks that are now here today that have an opportunity that Isaiah has today. Well guys, thanks a lot. Isaiah, congratulations. Thank you.